to a high-profile lawsuit in St. Louis. The city's chief prosecutor is now accusing the city and the police union of a racist conspiracy to block her reforms. Today, a group of prosecutors coming forward to support her, but her critics tonight say she's just not good at her job. ABC's Steve Osinsami from St. Louis. This is the woman in the center of the storm tonight. Kimberly Gardner is St. Louis's first black prosecuting attorney, and in a bombshell lawsuit, she accuses the city and the police union of a racist conspiracy aimed at stopping her from doing her job. This suit is so important because the people of the city of St. Louis who represented me will not be intimidated. Here's another first. Black prosecutors from across the country, all of them women, came to St. Louis today to support her. Every prosecutor here has had similar experiences to Kim. Gardner is part of a new wave of elected prosecutors who've pledged to make the justice system more fair to people of color. She immediately stopped prosecuting small marijuana offenses and is refusing to try cases involving more than 40 arresting officers who she feels aren't trustworthy. But her critics point to her high profile case against the governor. An investigator she hired is charged with perjury and evidence tampering. Gardner eventually dismissed the charges against the governor, but a special prosecutor is now looking into her office. There's no way for her to, to prosecute criminals now, and I think she's destroyed her ability to be prosecutor. The police union tonight rejects being called racist and says that this prosecutor cares more about criminals than cops. David. Steve Osinsami in St. Louis. Thank you, Steve. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.